Welcome back. In this Blender video, we're going to look at edit mode and a nice feature which will split a face up into more faces. So you have a little more detail and more stuff to work with. Easier just to show you. This tool is called Subdivide. So first thing I do is I hit the tab key. I go into edit mode. I'm going to select a face. Whoops. So face. Right click. There's a face I want to subdivide. Uh, you can select more than one face at the same time if you want. I may as well try that. And you scroll down the Tools menu here, which pops up when you're in Edit Mode, and you'll see you have Subdivide. There's no hot key for this. Okay, You just got to click it here. I click Subdivide, and you'll notice it just split it into four. And now I did it again. It does it a little more. Basically, once you have that done, and you subdivide a surface, you'll notice sometimes you get some uh, triangles formed. Uh, which may or may not be what you want. I'll go backwards here. I'm just going to do it with one face selected. And I'll go subdivide, subdivide, subdivide. And basically now you have more detail in your model. And with this more detail, you can do all the things you've learned to do, like select a few things, you know, pull them out, push them in, rotate, size, scale, you know, whatever it is you're trying to do. Then when you go out of edit mode, you know, that's what your object ends up looking like. Okay, so that's subdividing. Now there's one warning with subdividing what it does. You're going to notice here when I go to edge select and I start right clicking on the edges, it has split this one edge that used to be one long edge. It's now made it into lots of edges. There's one big rule with quad, or sorry, subdivide, and subdivide, the rule is, you can only subdivide something that has four sides. So if I go to this face, this face has one, two, three, four sides. So if I select it, I can subdivide, and it works perfect. But if I go to this face and I try to subdivide, you're going to notice it doesn't work. It, well, you saw something happen. I'll do that again. Ooh, something weird happens. If you actually watch the vertice count up here, I have 90 when I subdivide. Ooh, I have 102, but no visible difference. The reason is, is this one up here isn't four-sided. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I actually think I have a couple here, too. So it's not a four-sided. It doesn't work. So when you do do subdivide, if it doesn't work, ask yourself, are you trying to subdivide something that has more than four sides? And if you are, it's not going to work. Okay, but that one will work. Okay, so this is a tool to get more faces and more detail into your objects. That's really it for subdivide.